going on guys? We are about to hit a push workout. So Max and I are both um, not attempting. We're hitting PRs on the Gotta flat have that bench. mindset, man. Gotta have that mindset. And uh, we're gonna be playing around with 315 today. <laughs> have you ever done 315? I have never done 315. I've, this is gonna like it's gonna explode. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, it's... I've never, I've never even done above 300, man. You really? Yeah. Oh wow. So we're gonna push Max today, and uh, I'm gonna push myself. Hopefully, break a PR. And it's gonna be a good session. Put some music on, and uh, we're using, and we're using the thick bar. Yeah, we're using a little thicker bar. It's gonna be nice. It's gonna be real nice. So let's do it. So going 300 pounds, um, some of y'all may not know, I've never done above 285. Usually I do pause reps, so this one will be a touch and go. Never even touched above 300, so excited. Amped up. Alright guys, so uh sit 315 for five reps and uh well, not even two weeks ago that was my goal for the end of this bulk 315 for five, one set of five reps. So uh instead of being happy with that, you know, yeah, I'm happy, I'm proud, I'm setting a new goal for the next four months. So that's accomplished and now looking forward. going on family uh, mr. Max tuning is in town all the up, way guys? from Richmond Virginia we're here in Houston and uh, getting a push workout in at the CG headquarters yeah uh, push workout Christian being a beast at bench it's it's really impressive and um, you know it, it, it shows in his training because like you see doing so much like tricep dominant workouts chest dominant workouts and it's like it, it shows I mean I I pre try to preach about my strength and then Christian can absolutely crush me at bench uh, it's not even that. It's just like we have different goals. Yeah, you know, Max wants to lift as much weight as possible for one rep. You know, <laughs> feet planted on the ground, ass on the bench, like perfect form, bench, squat, deadlift. So you tailor your training towards what you personally want to do, and um, your goal is powerlifting, yeah. straight up. My goal, being my goal, strong. my goal is to be strong. It's, it's like it's really addicting. And, and but like regardless, even if you do bodybuilding, even if you do powerlifting, like and it's a prime example of like you can do both you can you be can strong absolutely. and build muscle you can <laughs> look christian christian doesn't train powerlifting at all and he can smoke me in the bench press 
Yeah. And it's, it's, it's nuts. And it's, your squat's catching up, man. Squat's catching squat up. Squat is catching up. Tomorrow, in the next video, guys, we'll see if uh, we can possibly hit a 405. That's, I don't know, my back's kind of taxed. Nah, he can do 405. He, oh, he strained a lot on that, the fifth the rep fifth of rep. 315, really, really push himself, which is uh, crazy intense, crazy motivating to me, especially because I'm, it, it's almost to the point where like, I saw you go in the fourth rep and I was like, all right, that's it, that's, you're done, mm -hmm. you're done. And then it's, <laughs> one so, more. It's so much, it's so mental, guys. Like, I mean, literally before that set, I was like sitting on the bench and just you get in this mind state where I, my, I, you, can, I can, you can make your heart beat faster. You can get your heart rate up by just sitting there if you're focusing hard enough. And I feel like that's what was happening. And um, you have to know when to turn that mode on. Now, can you be in that mode every single workout, every single set, every single rep? No, but you need to know when to push yourself, when to kind of reach past those limits and barriers that you set for yourself. Yeah, and so. it's nuts too because I, um, I always – try to preach to everyone to you know go in the mindset that like the weight's going up like you will yeah. get this rep you will get this weight um but like sometimes even i was kind of i've never done gone above 300 so when i went 300 and 315 and like it's you feel how heavy it is and then you instantly for like a half a second you're like crap this is heavy crap this is heavy if you doubt for that little 0.25 you know a, yeah. a tiny little millisecond you've already knocked down your you've potential knocked down your potential um but that's, it's almost like no one masters that. You know, if I went, you know, 20 pounds heavier, I probably would have done the same thing. But it's a mindset of trying to, I don't know, just be strong, mentally tough. And, yeah. Uh, just because you're mentally tough doesn't mean you're going to be the strongest person in the room. Don't get me wrong, but it's just yeah. uh, it's something you can work on over time. I am mentally stronger than everyone in the yeah. room. <laughs> with their team. But uh, dope session. Um, definitely, you know, being around him motivates me more to work on the bench, even though work on the bench as much as possible. It's just nuts, man. It's just crazy to see how strong you are. Bench, man. God. The older you get, the smaller your friend circle is going to become. You're going to have more acquaintances, less close friends. And I'd, I'd rather have five good friends, three good friends, three people I can rely on um, trust. through anything and trust through anything as opposed to just knowing a whole bunch of people. And um, as you get older, you kind of realize that. And surround yourself with those people. They're not only going to – you're going to better each other and kind of feed off each other. Max has strong points where I have weaknesses. I have strong points where he has weaknesses. And that's how you build – yeah, you pick, pick each other's yourself. brain, you pick each other's you know, ideas yeah. about anything, whether it be business, fitness, strength, physique, button downs. Shirt length. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, different stuff, but it's Circumference really, of the sleeves. And you help each other. Yeah, it's, you help each other become successful. I mean, if there's anything that I can help him do, um, then you know, we do it. Uh, and uh, that's, that's the key to success. That's friendship right there. <laughs> See you on the next one. Yeah. <laughs>